dear friends this is my tutorial 43 in Gaussian in this tutorial I am going to teach you basis set for iodine and bromine containing molecules so here I chosen that uh, model complex is model system is iodobenzene so first I did with that uh, geometry optimization of this iodobenzene using 631 G star basis set then I also did 631 G star combining with Lanel 2DZ basis set so first I tried with this uh, system with 631 G star basis set just I will show you the input file so if you want to see molecule you can also see molecule using gas view you can open your gas view software just you can drag that input file so it will show this this is that of iodo benzene so i will show you that input file with notepad plus plus so this is the input file for iodo benzene first you have to mention the percentage hk equal to c6h5 this name of the iodo benzene that name just i type dot chk then you have to mention memory 6mw and the n4 shell equal to 2 so if you are using linux system this may vary so i am using here windows only that's why i mentioned the 6mw 6mw 6 million words so here i mentioned only two cores my computer laptop will use only two cores to uh, optimize this iodo benzene then you have to mention uh, theory then this is the general uh, root section keyword you have to mention then you have to mention opt and frequency this will do first automation then followed by the frequency calculation then you have to give space then you have to mention that c6 uh, the name of the system then uh, space then you have to mention uh, zero means charge total charge is zero air spin multiplicity is one this is the cartesian coordinates of the uh, iota benzene uh, this is the carbon H and I present in that iodobenzene molecule. Then you have to give space. Then you have to mention what are the atom present in the molecule. Then you have to mention zero. Then you have to put uh, your basis state, six three one G state basis state and four stars. That means end of the basis set. Then you have to give some space and save it. That's all. So now we will run this calculation using uh, uh, Gaussian. I already run this calculation with uh, Gaussian. Here. So I will show you the what are the error we got, what error we uh, we found. So this is the output file. Just I will open. So if we go down here, you can see that error. So the atomic number out of range for 631 G star basis set. That means this basis set is not uh, until this this iodine benzene car system. So because we have to use that uh, for iodine, we have to use different basis set. So you, you so this is the output file. I will show you what are the error we error we have we observed. So this is the output file you will see that error what we get so just to open that uh, output file with notepad plus plus go down if we go down you will see the atomic number out of range for 631g basis set that means uh, this basis set cannot handle that iodine i iodine and also bromine containing system so we have to use different basis set for I iodine and bromine uh, containing systems so this basis it will handle that carbon hydrogen but cannot handle that iodine and uh, bromine because that as the more electrons compared to the um, carbon hydrogen so that's why we have to use different basis set I, I, I will show you how to choose that basis set for uh, this kind of iodine and uh, bromine containing uh, systems so for that just to visit your uh, that uh, basis set exchange data here you can see uh, orbital with ecp so if you see here here you 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 can use this kind of basis set for the higher uh, number of electron uh, metal atoms um, metal atom or uh, a other atom also so here you can see i generally use a lanyl 2d basis set for metals so here i can uh, select that lanyl 2d metals 
so if you select the lnl 2 dz see all the uh, maximum atom highlighted so it will handle that that iodine and bromine also okay you can use this uh, lnl 2 dz basis set for this uh, um, bromine and iodine system if you want also you can use this kind of basis set so based on your preference you can choose i basically choose this lnl 2 dz basis set that's all so likewise you can choose your basis set so i will also show you that uh, another basis set what we choose the 631 g star basis set so we can can six three one G star basis set so this is that thing so first we use the six three one G star basis set so here you can see uh, if you choose 631 uh, G star basis set, it will see show you up to the organ only. So, if, uh, this bromine iodine it cannot include it, not included because that, that's why we have to use different basis set for this uh, bromine and iodine systems. So, that's why it's showing that uh, here it is out of range basis set for 631 G star. So, this is that thing. So, then I did this calculation with the ECP basis set that means lnl 2 dz So, the calculations uh, uh, run smoothly. So, I will show you that input file. So, this is the input file for uh, iodobenzene. So, this up to here everything is same. So, here basis set only you have to change this uh, uh, base set so carbon nitrogen and uh, i mentioned the 631 g basis set for in that case for case for iodine i use the lnl 2 d set this is for valence electron you have to mention the four star then you have to give space then you have to mention again i and zero and you have to mention lnl 2 d set this is for the core electron then finally you can give enter then you can save it you can submit your calculation using uh, gaussian windows version or linux version the calculation will proceed smoothly so here what you have to do if you are using this bromine and iodine system you have to use ecp basis set like lnl 2 dz any other things so this is the things so then i have submitted this calculation using that gaussian i got that uh, output file so this is that uh, output file so if you go down so here the normal termination of Gaussian 0 9 calculation you can also do this kind of calculation for your system and you can understand easily how to choose the basis set for this bromine iodine systems so that's all So thank you for watching, if you like my content please like, subscribe, comment and share to your friends. Thank you, thank you for watching, thank you.